Okay, girls, so can you tell me what your names are, how old you are, where you come from, and the majors and minors that you've studied on this course? I'm going to start. Sure. Um, my name is Roxy. I'm 16. I come from Canada, but I live in the States. Um, my major for this course is psychology, and my minor is sociology. Um, also, my elective was debate. Uh, I'm Christina. I'm also 16. I'm from Germany, and my major was uh, advanced medical biology. My minor was critical thinking, and I also took debate as an elective. So can you guys tell me about debate? What did you get out of that? <laughs> Um, well, first of all, I feel like I got over the fear of public speaking. I mean, I don't know how it was for you, but... Um, for me, I found that working together in a team to create kind of like a yeah. universal kind of um, position on a topic that we got to decide ourselves was really interesting because sure. we had to work with different positions of different people that were coming in from all over the world, and then we had to kind of consolidate them into an argument or many arguments that um, helped our case. Yeah, I also like how we work how that kind of fighting of the topic <laughs> at the beginning, like over the progress of the different lessons kind of turned into a more civil debate. It was definitely um, competitive. Yes, I seem definitely. to remember a lot of times our teacher returning to our classroom with brownies and, and, and ice cream and, um, and well, we I mean, made sure you know. to, like, to like understand the, the terms of the bribery. <laughs> so can you say what was the subject of the debate? Okay, so our proposition was this house believes that the positive consequences of globalization for both developing and developed countries outweigh the negatives. Mm, so it's something that you both really enjoyed. Yes. Yeah, I mean it was definitely a topic that we could elaborate on like in our own ways and then use indirectly personal experience by sure. yeah. And I mean I also thought it was such a great topic because I mean this course is kind of promoting globalization because we're all from different countries. I mean and I think there were more than five people in the country. Well, I think you like that argument because your proposition. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, I disagree. Well, I mean, <laughs> you wanted the answer, it's all cool. That's true. So, Roxy, can you tell me about psychology? Um, How was your tutor? Did you get a lot out of your course? Definitely. I took psychology because um, in my school there's only a one year option of the course and I wanted to pursue it. So, um, in this course specifically, it was very challenging I'd have to say um, because we just kind of jumped in we went from history to um, many other more modern experiments and thinking styles um, but I thought it was a good balance of kind of introduction and then also like adding on to previous knowledge that I have so I thought it was great so you think it'll be useful when you go home for sure I, I mean I went over the kind of curriculum with my psych teacher in my school and she said that I basically covered the whole course so perfect and can you tell me a little bit about medical biology oh uh, well I mean I took a class because um, I'm quite interested in science in general and that was kind of the closest that was kind of the one that um, intrigued me the most and uh, I mean it was great we had two different tutors uh, one for more the biology stuff of neuroscience and then one for more like immunology so more medicine and I mean they were both amazing we learned a lot it was uh, very fast paced, I have to say that, but I mean, uh, they made such a good job to kind of um, ensure that we all really understood what was going on. Well, I say we all, we were only two people. <laughs> but, um, so do you think it really helped that you had a small class? Yes, definitely. It was very interactive? Yes, yes. Really good. So what else have you enjoyed outside of academics? Have you had fun <laughs> meeting people from all over the world? For sure. For sure, yeah. Um, this morning, I cried when people left, <laughs> which is kind of typical for me, but um, through the two weeks, I mean, just bonding over like our course workload yeah. <laughs> and coming home a little I would say frazzled and like Definitely. overworked and then yeah I mean just bonding with people around um, making new friends for sure I have a bunch of friends from all over the world who um, have invited me to come stay with them. Very nice. So do you have a highlight of the course each of you? I'm going to say the planting trip. <laughs> you have one academic one and oh, one social okay. one. Um, <laughs> academic, oh god. Maybe the debate. Well, yeah, I mean, can I have the best of both? Yes. So my sociology teacher was amazing. Um, we basically, um, it was kind of an interactive course, so like there was a set topic and we had a general like overview, but we could speak about whatever we wanted to. Mm -hmm. um, so for example, if one day we felt like talking about like genders, um, like the, the role of gender in terms of um, criminology in the overall topic of sociology, then we could definitely discuss it. And our teacher was really, I would say, lenient, and also she brought us a lot of food, so that was awesome. very nice. <laughs> Always helps. No, I mean, the debate was definitely a highlight.
my bra uh, purely academic, um, just I think like the general knowledge that you just don't get in the normal school curriculum. Um, and we kind of just thought every single person here is very interested in actually pursuing learning, which is not normally the case in normal school. So I think that's my academic highlight. And do you think that living in an Oxford college has really helped you get an idea of what life could be like if you came to university in the UK or to Oxford specifically? I mean, I I've think studied so. a lot. Yeah. <laughs> and true. Uh, very true. At first, I tried studying only after 11 p.m. every night, which I later found out does not work. <laughs> um, but I've actually I sat in places where I would expect people who study here during the school year would sit, and I felt very smart. So very <laughs> that was good. A good thing. <laughs> Thank you, girls. Thanks very much. Thank you.